Alright, so this is just a little demo of the menu I've been working on for the BGMC31 game that I'm working on with Adrian's. Uh, and I've been working on this menu a lot this past these past two days. And I'm going to demonstrate some of the things I've made for it. So, as you can see right here, uh, so if you don't already know, I've been writing a network script for this game. And it runs off a server. So... If I play the game, and as you can see, the server is off right now, so it's not running. So if you put your mouse over online, you can see it says connect, connect to the server. Um, and let me just uh, talk about what else you can see in this menu here. So I've got the uh, heads up display in the background that I made myself. I've got some kind of uh, cell hexagon honeycomb shape in the background that got a node set up that makes a flash like this. Um, I've got a control button uh, layout down here in the bottom left corner. And of course you can hover over controls and see the rest of the controls used to play the game. Also I've got my credits and I've got the uh, text animated to fade in and out when you hover over different buttons, just like that. They're not clickable right now, but I will have to set that up later. So, if I start my server, it's now running, and when I connect to the game, now you can see if I hover over online, you can see zero out of nine players online. So if, let's see here, say someone does connect to the game, I've got this network test blend going on right here. It's basically just a client test I've made to test the network capabilities. So I'm going to move this over here. Put this over here. Alright, so currently if I hover over online, it'll say 0 out of 9 online. If I start this game, you can check the server. It says user255 has joined. Now if I hover over online, it'll show you that 1 out of 9 players is online. And just to test, just to show you guys how this uh, network test goes, I'll pull up another instance of the same blend. Put them side by side right here. And as you can see on the left side, I'm the green cube, and on the right side, I'm the red cube. That's just the different colors are to show that you are a different person from the other player. And there can be up to uh, nine players, including yourself, in the game. You can bump into people. And yeah, that's about it. And let me just show you what happens if two players connect. Oops, let me fix that. So if I go back to the menu here, put my mouse over online, you can see that there are now two out of nine players online. So this value does change in real time as users join and leave the game, so you can always know if you are able to join a game or not. Alright, that's going to be it for this video. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more updates for this game, and I will post the final game video once it's done in about two or three days. Thanks for watching.